Back at lovely PPC Newlands for this second Momentum One Day Cup semi-finals. The WSB Cape Cobras up against the Hollywood Bets Dolphins. The toss took place a little earlier and Keshav Maharaj called incorrectly so that Rory Kleinfeld had the option and he's decided to field first. Shot on the up. That's nicely easy. He hasn't forced it, but the timing and placement is very, very pure from Sorrel Irvia. Edged and wide of the slip and down to third man for four. Takes the single, Irvia was ball watching. Oh, my word. They've run each other out during the course of the campaign, but Ervia was ball watching. As Van Veek came down and hit it to mid on, he turned to look to where the ball was going instead of trusting his partner's call, and he set off very late. Pulled away. The, is that going all the way? That's his strength. Morning, Van Veek. Yes. That's six runs. This is pulled away by Ervia in, in control and he gets himself another boundary. That's a good shot, that. It really is. From it wasn't a bad bouncer at all. He isn't. He's right on the money. He's got to go here. The shy. Oh, that was close. Well, there's an awareness that they want to rotate the strike with singles, but this was sharp fielding and had an opportunity. That's a good shot. That really is well placed. Down the wicket. That's good footwork. And it's smashed away through mid wicket. And it brings 50 for Mornay van Veek, his 43rd 50 in his second of this uh, summer's campaign. Just too much leg side from, from Linda. And that goes all the way for four. And Sadal Ervia gets another 50. I've always liked him as a player. I think he gets into good positions. This is another 50 for him against the Cobras. That is a beautiful shot by Mornay van Veek. Did not try and overhit this. It was all about placement. A change in field meant that Mornay van Veek tried to go to his favorite shot and he chops this one onto his stumps. Oh, oh chance, chance! Yeah, easy out! Easy out! They've gone upstairs. Dane Pitt with a throw. The ball normally wins the race. Although it's not the best throw, it's still good enough. To find him short and out is the signal so they lose another he's gone for seven 137 for two yeah! fold him the momentum is definitely changing this game okay. yeah he's gone without scoring Dane Villas 138 for three now Edged. Oh, oh catch what a catch! That is superb. Makanya goes. It just drifted in Pitt's involvement and his ma magic continues. Dane Pitt has struck again. Makanya goes cheaply. Makanya has to go. Nikajima took a great catch. 148 for four. Short delivery. Pulled away. An opportunity taken by Simon Komari. Mutasami, he's on his way for 20. Dolphins, 191 for five. Oh, hello. We're talking about inventiveness. You don't get more than that. Well, that is a brilliant shot. It really is. Up in the air it goes. He's going to be out. He's denied the 100. Verona takes the catch. Nabe keeps on the wicketing trail. Erve goes for 93. It's 214 for seven. Every time he's gone for a boundary, the next delivery, or soon after, he's picked up a wicket. He has been superb. He's very excited. The Dolphins, 
214 for seven. Could be a wide. Oh, they're going to run and they're going to be out anyway. Oh, it's no wide signal. It's a run out off the last ball. There's a complete misunderstanding. One wanted to go, the other didn't. So the innings has ended exactly the same as it did in the first semi final, with the batting side first being bowled out for 230. Big shout, big shout, and given. The informal line has to go back to the changing room. Rob Freilink, he gets the big wicket. Cobras is an early one. A five for one. Got him. Brilliant bowling this by Shezzy, and he gets his first. The Cobras, they're in early trouble. Ten for two. Another good shot. It was beautifully struck and gone. My goodness. What an opening start this is for the Dolphins. And Dane Villas broke the stumps first. Calvarini is gone for six. Oh. Shot. It's going for six. It's too short and it's been hammered onto the bank. That's come from nowhere, but that's a splendid shot from Hamza. No. Yes! Down the ground, an opportunity. Taken! Yes, Brilliant catch! Come on. He's picked the man, Vernon Villander. That looks like it's out to me. Let's have a look. The decision is out. Well, that's a massive wicket. In big trouble, the Cobras at 56 for four. Ah! Big shot, WW. Give it out. Another big wicket. So Hamza, he's gone for 26. Cobras now 57 for five. Yes! Leading edge, and just as I said, this partnership needs to grow. And Muta Sami, he gets his man. Oh, he's gone, he's gone up for the catch. He's got him, Robbie Freiling strikes straight after drinks. Cobras again in trouble. 126 for seven. Down the ground, all the way for six. That's good timing from Patterson. That's a good shot, over pitch this time. Down the ground, powerfully hit. And again, it's six runs for Patterson. Again, a great strike. Across the line, and that's four more for Dane Pitt. Yeah. Heaved it to the leg side, chance taken. Morne van Veik. And Dane Pitt has to go, and he played so well. So very well played. 54 Cobras, 175 for none. Shorter delivery and brilliant catch by Dane Villas and the Dolphins go through to the final and the Dolphins well they win by 49 runs and they'll be hosting the momentum momentum one-day cup final